the triple Elvis. Ferris type. Selling here. 73 is here. And Francis. Fair warning. With you, Isabel. Yours it is. Sold at $73 million. But it was the highest total for any single sale. Uh, the sell rate was also phenomenal. We were in the high 90s. Um, so there were very few paintings which didn't, didn't sell. It's to do with the quality of the objects. As long as we can bring works which are of the rarest, of the highest quality, of the best condition, of the freshest material. And one of the things which is very much pertinent to our market, the post-war contemporary market, is this is a market that's coming of age. You have a taste line which is very, very specific, i.e. you're dealing with collectors who are globally. If you look at the average age of the collectors, they're young collectors. I think one of the most important parts about confidence in the market, if you talk about it purely from an economic point of view, if you look at any other marketplace, you look at the ups and downs of the stock market, if you look at the ups and downs of the real estate market, the one market that has remained incredibly constant in the last two or three years has been the art market, the global market, and that's something which I think has really driven our prices to the highest level.